What's going on guys and welcome back to Sons of the Forest. We are now moving on to day number four and today is going to be a little bit defensive because as we know winter is fastly approaching and we need to prepare ourselves for the onslaught that the cannibals are more than likely going to bring to us. So I've just gone to get some water and me and Calvin have been deciding what we want to work on, what we want to do today and he's eager he's ready to work and what i'm looking at thinking about doing is i have obviously put this one trap down and there's one downside well technically two is one i keep walking over it so i need to put some form of indicator down where i put my traps but also the wildlife are triggering the traps as well um it just randomly goes off every now and again it does freak me out and it only to find out a squirrel has gone along it. But also, what I'm thinking about doing is because we are in a very, very vulnerable position right now, we've got all this forest around us and they can come from any direction. And it's going to take some time for us to build a wall. Because uh, obviously it's just me and Calvin and there's a lot of trees around. So the only thing I'm thinking about doing is making a backup location for us to retreat to in case of the inevitable. So I've been looking at these trees... And then I've been looking at the tree platforms and I'm thinking, why not do we not form some form of tree colony over in these trees? But we do have to be very, very careful of Calvin chopping these trees down because we don't want that, right? So, because I'm looking at this, I'm like, can I line this up here like that and then line another tree house up to this one like this and try to get that to line up and then possibly make a bit of a tree small little bridge going across there and then the only thing we've got to be careful of is that calvin does not chop them down so i don't know if we're just gonna stop him from getting wood for now um or we get him to get logs but i chop the trees down and he dumps them so i can get this bit done if that makes sense so I'm going to get Calvin to follow me real quick. And I'm hoping, I'm hoping to God, is if I bring him over here, I can get him to drop logs here. So I want him to get some logs. And I want him to uh, drop here. Right? And hopefully he goes over there and... Wait, let me chop a tree down first. Hopefully. Oh, wait, he's going over there again. Never mind. Where's my... My axe? Do I not have this equipped? Oh, I've got the club, haven't I? It's because I've all... Technically, I should use the axe. And equip that there. Because the axe does pretty good damage. And then hopefully, if I start chopping these trees down... He'll start picking them up. The only problem is, is I'm super tired right now. There we go. He's going to get some logs. I'm also thinking about maybe looking to find out where these cannibals are coming from. And maybe take the fight to them. And to be honest, I think that would be a good idea. Maybe we'll slow them down, their attacks down. Or maybe with them we only need to focus on one side. But these are going to require a lot of logs. I think it's over like 36 logs in total. And then I need the rope to do the bridge and all that kind of stuff as well. So we do have one rope bridge here and one on this side. I think I might put the rope on this side to climb up. Oh, we can't put it down yet until the, the logs are done right. And I've just walked into the goddamn thing again. I really need to move this. Uh-oh. What is that? Hello? That's a big guy. Calvin? Is that is that trap going to get him? Well, that is one big guy. Give me that arrow back. That is a leader, isn't it? Got to keep tagging him in the head like this. Damn, you're ugly. 
Oh my god, he's getting it. That's three headshots now. That went over. All right, Calvin. Quick. Swipe. Ah! I just ran into my own bloody trap. Oh, come on, die. There we go. Bloody hell. Four? Was that four arrows into his head? Jesus. Do you drop? Oh, you did. You dropped a pouch. What's it got inside of it? Okay, some duct tape. Definitely need that. Some wire and some coins. He come alone, though. The next time we face one of these, I don't think he's going to come alone because that's a brute right there. But anyway, let's crack on with this. And hopefully we can get this built as soon as possible. I best light this body on fire overnight. Before they come and feed on it. Alright, so after about 30 minutes or so, we've finally got the first one done. We've not had any incidents from any cannibals or anything, but there is a storm in right now, as you can tell. And Calvin has been just grabbing the logs, placing them down. He took a little break, so... I'm just wondering what we can actually do up here. Gotta try and climb this. Oh! Just in time. The only problem is, though... <laughs> is I don't think Calvin will climb up here. Or for that matter, if Virginia will. Or even worse, if the cannibals can. But as we can see, it's a very, very small area. But if we try and make this one and string a bridge to go across here, and maybe even more, is to try and look at something over there and get another bridge and kind of create like a little network in the trees. I think that might be pretty decent. The only thing we've just got to watch out for is Calvin chopping one of these trees that we occupy down. We've got two of them down there. So we're on day eight and it's quarter past two in the afternoon. And I've just seen two of these. There's one right there and there's, there's a second one. I wonder if I can shoot him down from there. I can. That one's a little too far away, but I'm just, let's see and wait if this other one goes to eat his friend. So let's give it like a second. He actually is. Oh, we, oh, we tagged him. I thought I actually got him in the head. Whoa. Okay. Um. That's low-key terrifying. I thought it was at the bottom, but... Interesting. Let's pick up this guy. And throw the body down there. And climb down. The next thing I need to think about doing is making some form of platform to actually take logs up there. So that's the next thing I need to think about. Let's get that arrow back. And let's burn these bodies. There we go. Alright, Calvin. After your break, I actually want you... Uh, actually, hold on. I want to make... Some... Um, some, like, stick collection points. The stick... Uh, oh, it's not going to be in there, is it? It's going to be in this book instead. Where is it? Here we go. Stick storage. I want to place a couple of these down. So Cal Calvin can fill it. I think four should be enough. And then if I tell Calvin to get sticks and fill holder, he should fill that until it's full. Because to make a lot of things, we need a lot of sticks. And especially if I want to make a perimeter. Uh, and we're going to go with maybe a fence for now. Because I don't want him chopping these trees down. I don't trust him <laughs> with chopping logs at the minute. So for now, 
I'm going to have to do it. But you can see that we are starting to clear a bit of an opening over there. And I am debating if to get rid of the chunks as well, because I don't know if the trees are going to regrow. I don't know if it's going to come back in springtime next year, or, or, or if there's a cycle yet. Uh, it might not be implemented, but we will see. So I'm just going to keep doing this. Until I get it done. No oh god. One of them's back. Oh. That was close. You're right. Back up. You guys, to be honest, aren't my concern right now. Because you don't really pest the Kelvin anymore. I wonder if I can find this arrow or that. I don't think I can. I can't even find this body. Like, they blend in so well. Oh, hello. Hello, hello. You're getting a lot closer now, aren't you? <laughs> She's dancing. Never thought you'll see. What, what happened then? She looked to the left. Oh, she's coming back. You gonna dance again? No? I'm worried sometimes. It's like, one of these days, she's gonna do that, and I turn around, there's gonna be one of them big brutes behind me, you know? It's one thing I'm worried about. Right, before we get to sleep, let's have some food. And I guess we can, for now, let's just have a an energy drink. And hopefully we can wake up feeling refreshed. Because every time we wake up in the morning, I still feel tired. But let's get some sleep. Yeah, we're definitely feeling a lot more energized this, en energized? <laughs> uh, energized this morning. So let's get some more logs done and let's get this done up here and then i need to figure out uh, a platform or a, something to get up there so i can put that bridge into place oh god we got another hunting party i was literally just clearing out these bushes here so we can have a bit more of a view but they're climbing the tree they're literally climbing my tree house i don't think they can get up there though god damn it That's one. This one's got a mask on. I'm not getting back up. There's one more somewhere. There he is. Oh, damn it, I don't have a... Whoa. I'm using the force again. Alright, the arrows are definitely, definitely useful. Just stunning them if you get a headshot like that. Especially because they run at you straight on. Super, super beneficial. I think the one thing I'm worried about is when the groups start mixing. You know, these are just like the normal cannibals, but if they mix a leader in there and some other... Variants. That's when things can get a little interesting. But I've noticed the, it looks like they're coming from the paths. So I'm just debating if to put maybe the traps on the paths. That's a couple of times I've seen them come that way and from that path direction. Hmm. Maybe. Ugh. Is there any more? All right, back to clearing these down again. I'm literally just clearing the foliage so we've got some visibility. At least having a 
visual in one direction. At least we can understand what we're coming up against before it happens. I'm going to put my weapon away. Oh, I did put my weapon away. For some reason, it just come back out again. Calvin still collecting the sticks. He must have collected lords by now. I think we only need, what, two more logs to get that done? Which I've got here. To help me out so I don't have to travel as far. Because I want to try and keep these trees intact here. In case we want to build more tree houses and more of a bit of a tree kingdom, I should say. I do want to expand this out. But I feel like this is a lot more safer for now. Instead of, you know, being in a little vulnerable shack. Um, but Calvin's been grabbing the sticks. And I think he's got quite a few of them. Let's put that into there. Just like that. And now I need to connect this up via a rope system. And if we climb up, I don't think I'm going to be able to. Let's, uh, let's grab ourselves a rope here. I can attach that. Wait a minute. Can I attach that? Can I jump across here? Oh, I can. Oh. I can do a bridge there. It doesn't have to be in the middle then. And I can actually walk along this and I've got I've got this. Oh, that's pretty decent. I wonder what other tree I think I can connect to about that third tree back there and make another one so I've got like a a long stretch. That's not a bad idea actually. The only thing I need to think about doing now is actually getting these logs up here. How much damage do I take if uh, Oh, I don't. Okay, that's fine. So I can literally just jump off there. Alright, so now it's just... Can I reach this? Or do I... Can I do it from down here? I don't think I can do it from down here. Okay, so what I need to do... Is I need to make... A stump, kind of, right? Put that down there. Connect that there. Get two more logs. Then put you there. Climb up, put you along there, and then get two more logs and place you like that. And hopefully, that should be enough. All right, let's see. Can I? Oh, we can. Wait, there was no indication, so I'm just wondering if I could do it from the ground. So let me get one of these logs. Wait, I did pick it up, right? Oh, it's, it's there, but I can't reach it. Okay, so yeah, I've got to put this down here. And it does look like I've got to climb up there and place them. Okay, we're nearly there. There's just a couple more. I think it works pretty well as well, you know. Even though that's clipping here, I'm actually okay with that. Because it means it keeps kind of organized, you know? If I wanted to put it, like, here, I'll have to put, like, a log down there, I think, and then attach it to that log, very much like it has done here. So let's place these last bits, and I think that should be good. Actually, that doesn't need to be there. There we go. We got it. And I can build off this if I want to now. She's not so bad. The only problem is, is Calvin can't get up here, I don't think. He's listening to get, like, beaten up down there. <laughs> we can't have that. The other thing I'm wondering is what else can we do up here, right? Because if I can put this here, how can I make... Because I can't put any supports here, right? I can put a support on the ground, but then I'll have to build that support up to place this here to then do a strut to make sure I can connect these together. Does that make sense? Hopefully it does. I'm hoping these guys can't chop the trees down, though. Or even the cannibals. What sound was that? Or even the cannibals, for that instance. Oh, my boy, Calvin. Look at all these sticks you've gathered. Nice. I've got no arrows. You throw rocks at me. I 
I saw him pointing, but I didn't know if I'm guessing he was pointing at this one. I just want Virginia to trust me. You know. It's okay, you can come. <sighs> Hopefully soon. Let's get all these sticks. These are what Calvin plays earlier on. And I can store this in here and help him out a little bit. So obviously I don't have the grapple gun yet. And that'd be pretty nice to have. Okay, let's make some more arrows before we get some more company because definitely the boar is the way to go store them oh, i need some more i need one more pebble at least let's let's just put that down in case oh okay i've got no weapons out hi virginia hello oh, you still don't trust me yet do you hopefully soon i think it's because i looked away when she was dancing that was one of the little trust things I needed to do. I'm literally looking for pebbles right now. So I can get some more arrows done. And I'm thinking about maybe putting a chest up there or even a shelving just with extra arrows in as a backup. And hopefully, they, like I said earlier, I don't think, hopefully they can't climb up there, you know. So one thing I've figured out is you can actually put the stick in the ground. Get yourself your axe. And you can actually knock this and make it into a little bit of a hedgehog. But you can take it one step further by getting the rocks and placing it as a reinforced. Which is pretty decent. So we can put like multiple one of these down. I don't know how, you know, effective they're going to be at the enemies or damaging the enemies, but at least it's something and I don't know if it's going to hurt Kelvin either. But I feel like it's a good little thing to possibly do in the future especially around the house and can i i don't want to dismantle it just yet but i definitely want to organize this a little better and bring in the enemies into one direction but then again one thing i've got to think about are the enemies going to focus on the walls i've built rather than trying to go through the entrance i've built for them and if they go through the entrance you know bob's your uncle if they go for the walls it's gonna be a sad day Right, let's take a little trip out whilst we've got a bit of daylight left. And let's see if there is any camps near us. Oh, this radio's still going. Oh. You made me jump then, I'm not going to lie. Well, let's cut through the trees here. Because this is technically the edge of my forest right there. And my visibility. The path does come along here, but there could be something in the woods. There has to be something pretty close, right? There's a lake. This is actually really nice. Come to think of it, if I would have gone a little bit further, I could have built over here. You know? I would have had the the, the rocks, maybe just on the one of these cliffs here. But if I'm not mistaken, isn't this the waterfall where Virginia's dancing in the uh, in the trailer? Isn't this where they kind of show Virginia off at the first time? Like in that waterfall, just like bathing. Okay, so let's head up this side of our perimeter and see if there's anything here. There is another green icon there. Have we been to this one? I don't know if I've been to that one. Maybe I might I might check that out in a second. Okay, so I'm not seeing anything right now. I don't hear any music or or anything. I just feel like they're coming at us because they know where we are. Let's check a little bit more this way towards the roadside. Just gotta keep my head on a swivel like we normally do. I don't wanna get ambushed right now. I'm just waiting for one of them to scream out any second. I'm just checking what's at the end of this dead end road up here. 
because there's a pathway, as we can see, but it leads to nowhere. It literally is just a dead end. There's nothing here I can dig up, right? Seems not. I do see a cannibal over there, though. He's come from this direction, and this is not the open field that I'm normally at. Oh, there is a camp. Oh, there is a camp pretty close. Maybe. What's that sound? It's him praying. What the hell was the thing rolling? Oh. Okay, they see me. Hello. Hi there. Nice dodge. Damn it. There we go. Okay, there is one more somewhere. He's right there. Oh, two more, sorry. Oh, God, it's a big boy. Damn it. What the? He's picking up the body. Damn it! Grab you, grab you! Come on! We can do this! You're here as well now. Oh, Jesus! I didn't think it was going to come up on me that fast! Stay out of it for now, right now, all right? Come on, please be dead. He is. Oh, okay. I think we're in the clear. We've just got this stalker about. But I don't know if they're going to increase their threat level now that I'm... I'm in their camp. Gotta watch out for this guy, gonna sneak up on us. Because he will do. Break all this down. Get him out of here. I don't think I can collect any of that meat. Oh, Jesus. Okay, he's in that tree. I wanna put my weapon away. I don't think... Now's the time? I know, there's... Two of them. I should have opened my backpack there. That's another one right there. Where did that one come from? I don't know if that's part of this camp or not, but... I don't know if breaking these... Villages down... going to be beneficial to us, but... You little... It's getting dark as well. She's still up there. I think that's a female. I think I might just move here, to be honest. Get ready to go. I don't think there's anything else I can collect. Skulls. Get out that bit of cloth, though. Let me got that. Is that a crucifix? What is that? Oh boy. Alright, let's get back to camp. Let's get back before night time. Alright. Home sweet home. I don't think them stalkers have following us anymore. I don't think they have anyway. Alright, Calvin's still collecting these sticks. He's got so I don't know how many fits in a rack. But like he's got a lot. We're definitely gonna need a lot for the the fence anyway. But then I think I'm gonna get him to start working on some collecting some rocks. 
so we can reinforce the fence. Uh, the, uh, sorry, the, the little hedgehog defense things. 